I'm John Hudson, I'm the Dean and President of the Franklin Pierce Law Center, and I live in Bow, New Hampshire. I was in the Navy for 28 years. It was a, a great job. Uh, I felt good about what I was doing. There's a great John Kennedy quote that says that uh, if any man's asked what he did in his life, it's enough to say I served in the United States Navy. And uh, I, I think that's kind of true. I'm here today because I have, a, I have a confession to make to all of you. For my entire adult life, I was a registered Republican. And I'd never voted for a Democrat in my life. Shortly after the war in Iraq began, I became concerned about the way the United States was uh, treating detainees and our interrogation policies. We are running the risk of historians looking back on the first few years of the 21st century and saying that's where America came off the rails. That's where we began to be the next former world power. And so I started speaking out to raise those issues in uh, the public's awareness. And instead of inspiring the world with the power of American ideals, they offer war as a first resort. An overstretched military, justification for torture, and the trampling of civil liberties. I think America desperately needs a president who is inspirational. Somebody of the Kennedy or Reagan mode that, that can make us feel like we're going to soar again. But I stand before you tonight because all across America, something is stirring. What the naysayers don't understand is that this election has never been about me. It's about you. I also think that, the, that America desperately needs somebody who will be cohesive. We have been divided too long, the issues that we face are too grave, and we can't make those kinds of tough decisions unless we're all working together. After watching for these many months now, I've decided that uh, Senator Barack Obama is the one person that is able to lead the United States in a direction that I think that we desperately need to go. I have come here today from the great granite state of New Hampshire to, to declare myself a proud member of the Democratic Party and to endorse Barack Obama as the next president of the United States of America.